so I'm going to give you some inputs about the rise of the concept of geocommon in France. Um, it's like um, uh, past year, the French National Geographical Institute it like, uh, started communicating its vision towards to the, the, the development of geocommons, like uh, the common numerical common, but applied to ge geographical data, workflow, tools, build, and services, with a focus on co-building ecosystem. Um, for us, that was like, that sounded like a gear change uh, in the way the Institute apprehends geodata and geosoftware production. This is quite new for, for us in France because uh, from an institution that was used to working quietly from its uh, ivory tower, sometimes dropping data, sometimes dropping tools or services, but with uh, our workflow, bottom-up workflow, you know, for the feedback users. So it was, it was new and we, we were really, really attentive, you know. So one year later, we are, we are one, one year later, it's time to, for an assessment. Yeah, it was the latest buzzword in France to, to make EGN uh, rising up on Lake Nin, or is, is it a large movement towards to more openness in the geospatial realm, realm in France? Uh, that is, uh, that is uh, the, the question. So first time, the change of, the, the change of mind, of mindset, it uh, uh, impacted the, the EGN itself, sorry. Uh, it uh, concretely, there, there was a public consultation, really open, uh, wide open, and to gather ideas, feelings, and share vision from the ecosystem, uh, individual actors, associations, a civilian uh, uh, organization, and uh, also a public uh, and private organization, uh, obviously. This is not and, uh, like this is a concrete thing, it's uh, like a dedicated page on the official website, it's not so insignificant because it's like an official recognition of open concept and uh, it gives like uh, a great visibility uh, to, the, to this concept and uh, it drives some other concepts. We, 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 we love to, to share it at Force4G like open data, open code, etc. Another uh, initiative inside uh, within the, the, the EGN was, was the entrepreneurship with three selected topic uh, and uh, helping uh, some, someone to, to develop its ID outside uh, the, the institute, web, but with its help. Yes, you're right. Uh, uh, the image is not showing, I don't know why. And uh, the new national platform announced by the, by the EGN is like uh, uh, only based on FOSS. And uh, even if EGN has already a long tradition using and publishing some, some open source tools, it's like a great opportunity to move further and to contribute some, concretely some, mm, to, to some tools like PG Feature Serve, Rack for Tooling, or some open data really interesting like the LIDAR ISG at the French scale. Outside, there is like a, a wide, uh, this is, concretely there is a, a wide open forum like GeoCommon, and this is a really new also in France to see some geomaticians share like uh, uh, to think together about uh, what, what, uh, what is it a common, what is it a geographical data, really open, and etc. And obviously there is also Jean, a, home, a hot community, open street map, uh, community which is waiting for the EGN. Okay, we are ready. What are we doing together? And sometimes it's odd, it's a it kind of problem because people are making, we are making an amalgam between OpenStreetMap and GeoCommon. It's like a challenge for me. We are, if we can uh, go, go further and imagine other things than OpenStreetMap, uh, if, uh, even if it obviously it's a more advanced. Conclusion. It's a great public message, which is still developing, and finally align, aligned uh, with public money, public institute, public code, public data, etc. And uh, it's an important, an important commitment to uh, a national of a national institute of force ecosystem. Yeah, wow, it's a rush. <laughs>